First off, give all praise to you. How about Shem Yashai, the bonus to elders and apostles of GMS, salutes and honors to elect, the brothers in his truth who are enduring in sincerity. This is the brother Christ as I got another lesson coming back at you, GMS, the clay. And, um, you know, I was watching, uh, the, uh, the brothers down there in Dallas and, you know, they made a good point. I just wanted to piggyback off of it, uh, dealing with the scripture. Let me pull it up real quick. Uh, Luke 2 and 49, it says, And he said unto them, How is it that ye sought me? Wish ye not that I must be about my father's business? Now, the, that business is talking about the duty that we have in his truth. But, you know, carnally, like a, a business is somewhere that you go to make money. We're building up a spiritual bank, you know. So if you if you about your father's business, just like Ariella was saying, you know, if you take over the family business, you don't want to run that motherfucker into the ground. You want to succeed at it. You want to prosper. So that's how we got to be about this truth. We got to treat it like it's our business. We have to succeed. We have to prosper. You have to do your studies. You have to do things that's going to be fruitful for the business. Fruitful. So with this truth. It's things that got to be fruitful for the Akium. So, I mean, you got to you gotta figure out what you need to do to be successful. Like me personally, you know, um, like I just switched jobs and opposed to me working a 40-hour week, I'm working like a 52-hour week, 55-hour week. So I have less time. So... In order for me to be about my father's business and to be more fruitful, what do I have to do? I have to adjust my schedule and find times to study and find times to, to um, you know, do videos and whatnot. So I'm actually on a on the job right now. So that's what that's what I did. I figured out a way to to be more about my father's business while I'm you know, working for the white man. Because here, at this job, it's pretty much my own business. It is what I make it. And in its truth, that's exactly what it is. It is what you make it. So, I mean, everybody don't have, you know, the luxuries to, you know, to uh, to, to be at home all day and to just put up videos or the money to do this or the money or, you know, everybody got their own lot. It is what you make it with that lot, though. You know, you got to play the hand you dealt. When life gives you lemons, make some lemonade. So, I mean, that's that's pretty much all I really wanted to say. You know, we just, we got, the, the point is, we got to be about our father's business. And that's pushing this word out. And there's no excuse for not pushing the word out. You know, whether you're working more hours you know, whether you got a woman tugging and pulling at you, you know what I'm saying? You got to figure this out because what's the end goal? The end goal is to get the fuck up out of here. And we can all see that, you know, this place is done. This place is finished and it's drawing nearer and nearer every day with every breath we take. So what we got to do, we got to keep pushing. We got to push harder and Satan's going to throw them obstacles in our way, give you a job that, you know, pay more, but take up more of your time so you can't be with the brothers or you can't study more or you can't be with your woman now. She complaining, you know, Satan going to do those things, you know, so you just got to figure it out, man. You got to figure out what, what's your algorithm to, you know, defeating Satan and to push this truth. What's your perfect storm? What's your formula? How do you sneak in an extra lesson here or there or sneak in an extra uh, chapter a day or something like that? We just got to figure it out, man. It's like putting one of those Rubik's Cubes together, you know. We got to put the colors together. And with that being said, you know, Lord willing, you brothers will edify, you know, we give all praise to you. How about Shimmy Shai? Double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS. Salutes and honors to the elect. All the brothers in this truth who are enduring in sincerity and the women and the children who follow. Shalom. First off, give all praise to you. How about Shimon Shai?